Okay, two similar rugby balls are shown below. The volume of the larger rugby ball is 500 centimeter cubed. Calculate the volume of the smaller rugby ball. Okay, so um, because they're similar, we can find the scale factor. Okay, so they are told us the corresponding length scale of each rugby ball. So we can sort of look at the scale factor there. Yeah, there's there's two possible options, isn't there, with the length scale factor? Okay, um, so you've either got 32 over 26. So that's really comparing this one to this one, isn't it? That's the same what factor that it is larger in terms of the smaller one, or in reference to the smaller one, we can say, just flip it, we can say that this smaller one is basically 26, 32, 30 seconds of this, okay? So it's like a proper fraction, isn't it, of the larger one. So depending on what you're doing, whether you want to make it smaller or larger. Now, um, they, they want us then to look at the volume. We just need to appreciate that this is the length scale factor. To get the volume scale factor, okay, you have to cube it. Okay, so you have to cube the length scale factor. So um, because we want to find the volume of the smaller rugby ball, we want to make this smaller, I'm going to choose this one here, okay? And we need to cube this. So basically 26 over 32, and I'm going to cube it. All right? So all you do then is, we, won't, we don't even need to work this out. We will just take the 500 and times it by my volume scale factor and we will get our answer so 500 times bracket 26 over 32 cubed and that comes out to be 268.19 centimeter cubed and there's our volume of the smaller rugby ball.